This video will demonstrate palpation of the thoracic spine. So we're going to start with some central vertebral pressure, beginning here at T1. So start by doing a grade 2. And when you get to about T3, you can come around and switch the hand grip to use the ulnar border of your hand and continue to go at a grade 2. So before you hit resistance. If you have upper extremity symptoms, you usually palpate down to about T7. Any low back or lower extremity symptoms, you want to palpate all the way down to T12 as well as palpating the lumbar spine. If a grade 2 centrally was all clear, we would repeat at a grade 3 and then a grade 4. Come back up and assess unilateral pressure. Come off of T1 to the transverse process. And begin to assess. Once again, I'm about T4 here, but I'm going to walk around and change my hand position. And once again, if the grade twos were clear, we would repeat at a grade three, and if those were clear, again at a grade four. And then we're going to assess the costo-transverse motion. So for the sake of the camera, I'm going to assess this side. I'm going to take one hand and stabilize the contralateral side to what I am palpating. Start up at the second rib, use the ulnar border of my hand, and palpate along the rib. So this pressure follows the line of the rib cage. And that concludes palpation of the thoracic spine.